Hello, my name is Dana Mahoney and I'm a research analyst with Goldline Research. Goldline Research is an independent market research firm that evaluates professional services providers throughout the United States. We recently completed an evaluation of wealth managers, also known as financial advisors or financial planners, in the Great Lakes region. This presentation is a brief overview of our industry findings and recommendations. What are wealth managers? Wealth managers usually serve as a financial quarterback for your financial life and provide, or in some cases partner to provide, the following services. Financial planning, investment and portfolio management, estate planning, tax planning, retirement planning, and insurance, which is typically life insurance. Wealth managers are often paid in one of three ways, by commissions, for the sale of a stock or bond, for example, by a percentage of the investable assets that they manage for you, or by a fixed hourly rate, similar to how a lawyer is paid. Wealth managers are required to obtain state and or federal licenses for providing investment advisory services, insurance, or to assist you with purchasing securities such as stocks and bonds. The licensing information should indicate any disciplinary action or grievances against a wealth manager. What makes a good wealth manager? Here are a few things we found in our research. A good wealth manager is a good listener and a good communicator. Financial planning and investment advice requires objectivity and patience. A good wealth manager does not take a cookie cutter approach. For example, they customize financial, investment, and retirement plans based upon each individual client's needs and risk profile. With financial planning, there is no one-size-fits-all plan. Each person's financial situation is different and those needs must be addressed. A good wealth manager is not captive to a particular insurance company or mutual fund company. Captive agents are incented to put their interests before your interests because they are compensated by the insurance company or mutual fund company to sell that company's products. And a good wealth manager provides a range of wealth management services or has partnerships to provide those services. Some people need only financial planning or investment management while others need retirement planning. The leading firms offer a wide range of services to address all the needs of their clients. Goldline Research undertook a multi-month research process to evaluate wealth managers in the Great Lakes region, which includes six different states. During the process, we identified more than 10,000 professionals in the region that hold the CFP designation and more than 3,100 SEC registered investment advisors. We found that the typical firm in the region has 22 years of industry experience, employs three investment advisors, has almost 200 clients, and manages approximately $130 million in client assets. We found that most firms provide, at a minimum, financial planning services. However, more successful firms provide a wide range of services to address a range of client requirements, or they have tight partnerships with providers of those services. Based upon our experience in evaluating wealth managers over the last five years, there are a number of things that you should consider when working with wealth managers. Do work with firms that create customized financial and investment plans for you that addresses your financial situation and risk profile. Do work with firms that clearly explain their fee structure, for example, how do they get paid. And do ask to speak with clients like you to learn about their experience. Do not work with firms that are unlicensed and or that have complaints issued against them. The easiest way to do this is to review their state and federal licensing information. Do not work with firms that have lost more than 5% of their clients in the last 12 months, as this may be an indication of poor performance and or service. And do not work with firms that are captive to particular insurance and or mutual fund company, as they often do not provide objective investment options, unless those are the specific products that you're looking for. So in summary, there are more than 10,000 CFPs in the Great Lakes to choose from. We found that the typical wealth management firm in the region provides at least financial planning services and has more than 20 years of industry experience. If you need more than simple financial planning, make sure that the firm that you choose can offer additional services. Finally, we also recommend that you interview the firm and or advisor that you are considering to ensure that there is a good fit and the firm and or advisor is not a captive provider. If you have any questions or need more information about us, please visit our website at www.goldlineresearch.com or call us at 415-892-9400. Thank you.